hey guys welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to do something slightly different from what i usually do and this is the 20 random facts about me so let's get into it random fact number one i went to seven different schools when i was young so from kindergarten to about high school i've been to seven different schools random fact number two i lived in thailand for the past five years prior to moving here random fact number three when I was in Thailand, I was the only black kid in my school. So the whole dance school, I was the only little black girl running around. I remember wondering, why are my parents doing this to me? Why are they taking me to school where there are no other black kids that look like me? And I remember the first day, I was, you know, everyone was looking through their windows like, what is that? I was such a strange thing to these people that back then but it turned out not so bad like i had friends and made friends and it was not such a bad experience being the only black kid it was different to be in a surrounding where no one looked like you and you had to be you know interact and relate to people who are quite different from you and your upbringing and things like that but at the end of the day I think it just uh, groomed me to be better right now in terms of working with people that are different from me and uh, you know just uh, being able to fit in with different society. Random fact number four, I have one older sister. Random fact number five, I started vlogging way before I knew what YouTube was. I remember back in 2007 or so, I had my mom had this um, my mom had this camera and I used to take it and take videos and things like that. I don't know if it was 2007 or what, but this was way before I even knew what YouTube was. I have footage from back, 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 back then. Random fact number six. When my mom was pregnant with me, she had a bit of a complication with her pregnancy and she almost lost me. Can you imagine? When she told me that, I was like, oh my god, I almost did end up in this world. Like, there would have been a world without Camilla. It's so crazy. but. Thank God nothing happened and you know, I'm here today. Random fact number seven, I'm allergic to cats and dogs. Random fact number eight, I am anemic. A few years ago, I found out I was so tired all the time and things like that. So I was like, something must be wrong with me. So I went to the doctor and they did some tests and it turned out I was uh, moderate anemic. I'm not like very, very anemic. Random fact number nine, I am 100% Luo. I know a lot of people think I don't look Luo and they all give me all sorts of, you know, things or places they think they come from, but I am 100% Luo. Round of fact number 10. I am the laziest person you will ever meet in your life. I am so lazy. Like, I, which is sometimes a good thing. I can tell you it's a good thing to be lazy because, or some person said, I don't remember who it was. They hire the laziest people to do th things easier and quicker. And I'm telling you, I know I find the easiest and quickest ways to do things that other people do it and take so long because I'm so lazy. I'm like, I don't want to spend time or effort in doing that. So I get, I think about how I can do it quicker and easier and faster. Random fact number 11. When I was a child around seven, nine years old, that age gap, my mom used to take me and my sister to this place on Sundays where it was like family day and kids would come there and all sorts of things and have lunch and stuff like that and there was a dancing competition and I used to go there I think almost every Sunday and I won. I was such a dancer. I won so many times and I made so much money I bought myself a bike because I was so like into this dancing. <laughs> right now I'm dancing in front of people is I'm sort of shy about it. But so yeah I used to make money when I was about seven years old or so. I don't really don't remember how old I was. Let's call my mom and find out how old I was. Hello? Hey mom, so I'm filming a video and I'm just uh, cute. I'm wondering how old was I when I used to dance at that place and uh, I, you know, I want some money or whatever. <laughs> um, 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 I think you were four and a half, five. Four? I thought I was seven. Okay, four and a half. No! <laughs> Okay, all right. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. More than six maximum, but I think it's about five. Yeah. Okay. All right. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. All right, guys. You heard it. I was about four and a half to five years old, and I was the dancer. I was like, get it, dad, get it, get it. Random fact number twelve. I am such a jam freak. Like, seriously, I cannot touch handles in public. 
I avoid using public toilets like no one's business. I'd rather almost pee on myself than use a public toilet. And I don't like shaking hands and things like that. That's why if you meet me, especially if you're a guy, I will avoid shaking your hand as much as possible because I'm such a germaphobe. I just don't want it. I don't want your dirt, like people's dirt in my space. Mm -mm. Random fact number 13. When I was about 13 years old, I used to be a tomboy, like for real. I was a tomboy. I was always hanging out with the boys. I was always skating, I, uh, you know, rollerblading, skateboarding, cycling with the boys. I was just, I was finding so much interest in what the boys did more than the girls. Random fact number 14. I have a serious problem. This I did not know about till I moved in with Nick and then he told me. I never closed drawers like in the kitchen and stuff the drawers and the wardrobes i can go and get a glass of you know a glass to have something whatever and i will leave nine times out of ten i will leave it open even the drawers so now i try to make sure to think about it because otherwise you well, if i walk into the kitchen and, I, and you walk in after me you'll find all the drawers open you'll know where i have been because i always leave them open it's just so weird random fact number 15 i cannot finish the last bit of my drinks. If I have a glass, I cannot finish the little bit left at the bottom. I don't know why, I just can't do it. I cannot do it. It's different if it's in a... Actually not, even in a bottle or a can, like a can of cola or something, of coke. I just, I wouldn't, I wouldn't drink the last bit. I've tried it, Nick forces me to drink it, but I cannot do it. It's just, my well-being refuses to drink the last bit of drinks and it's such a bad habit random fact number 16 i have a stepdad so my mom raised me and my sister with a step papa that is who raised me random fact number 17 i love 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 music like i am obsessed since i was i guess that's why i was dancing when i was a little girl but i've always been obsessed and my boyfriend is not that into music, so he can tell you how irritating it can be when I want to listen to music all day. Random fact number 18, I overplan like all the time when I have I when I have something that I'm looking forward to or just in general, I literally spend my nights sitting like this, planning, planning, planning in my head. I don't even write it down usually. It's just a plan of exactly how I see the situation going and it often doesn't go like that and I get disappointed. <laughs> Random fact number 19, I cannot swim. But the thing is, if you threw me in the, in the pool or something, I will not drown. Do you get me? But I cannot swim. I, I wouldn't call myself a swimmer. And I remember when, <laughs> I remember when I was, um, I don't remember how old I was. My mom was so persistent in me learning how to swim. So she took me to, she took me to swimming classes and took me to a swimming school. And I just couldn't swim. I was just too scared or something. But because she wanted me to learn how to swim so much, when I got back home, she'd be like, so how did it go? Did it go well? I'm like, yeah, yeah, it went good, it went good. I can swim, blah, 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 blah. So one day she says, you know what? This weekend, whatever it was, we're going to a pool. We didn't have a pool at our house or anything. So we had to go to a hotel or something and to the pool there. So I remember, I remember her saying, okay, we're going to the pool so Camilla can show us her skills, you know. She says she can swim. It's been probably a couple of months since I started my swimming classes. But funny enough, she never really asked the teacher, I guess. I mean, I don't know. But I remember panicking, thinking, oh my God, I cannot swim. But I keep telling her I can swim because she's so into it. And I just want to make her happy and want to make her proud of me. So I just say I can swim even though... I full well know I cannot swim. So I remember going to this pool and it was like everyone's getting in the water. My mom is so, you know, proud and she wanted to show to her friends that her daughter can swim. <laughs> and I get in the water and I'm like, I cannot do it. I'm like, I cannot do it. I'm looking at her like, mom, I, I can't, I cannot swim. Look, I still remember the disappointment in her face because she really thought I could swim and um, I made her believe I could, but I really couldn't, so. Yeah. Random fact number 20. I love, love, love old English novels that are turned into movies like Jane Austen, Sense and, Sensi Sense, Sense and Sensibility, Pride and Prejudice, Jane Eyre. I love those oh my, movies. I can watch all day, all night those type of movies. I just can't. Mr. Darcy. I really cannot watch the modern day romance anymore. I just find them so corny. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. 
I hope there's some random juicy fact that you guys you know are surprised to find out about and uh, yeah so I hope you enjoyed the video and I uh, will see you in my next video bye